Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome. My name is Faith Hunter. And before we actually get started, I'm just going to burn a little Palo Santo. And as I am burning a little Palo Santo in preparation for our meditative practice, I'm going to encourage you to make sure that you grab everything you need. If you need support for your body for sitting, definitely grab a pillow or a meditation seat. All right. So make yourselves comfortable. I'm going to invite you to close your eyes. And if closing your eyes completely feels uncomfortable, know that you can simply cast the eyes down. Make sure your spine is straight. Soften the shoulders. And just simply start to take deep breaths in and out of your nose. Allowing yourself to arrive in this present moment with the support of the breath, grounding you into this earth, filling your spine up with loving, caring, and supportive energy. And also using this opportunity and the power of just the simple inhale and exhale to start to expand the mind, maybe clear out some of those negative thoughts. Those thoughts that keep us trapped in our loops Use the breath to make mental, physical, and emotional space for you to draw upon this powerful lunar eclipse energy. As you continue to breathe gently in and out of the nose and ground into your seat, Know that this moment in time that we're sitting in, this lunar eclipse, is the perfect opportunity to readjust, to reevaluate and assess. Now, all moons, right, all full moons are about letting go rearranging and setting things up differently. But this lunar eclipse is even more powerful. The portal is more expansive and it gives us an opportunity because it is sitting in the sign of Taurus for us to look at our overall health and well-being, our financial health and wealth. It encourages us to go inward. And it also cracks the door open so that we could look into our relationships, but very specifically looking at our relationship to self. Take a few more deep breaths in and out of your nose. And begin to think about those areas and realms of your life. The broad, expansive, overall well-being. looking at your emotional health, your spiritual health.
and maybe even thinking, where do I need to make some adjustments as it relates to my financial stability? Those tweaks may be small or massive disruption and reorganization needs to happen regardless of the size. Just allow yourself to think about, contemplate where those adjustments need to happen in your life. I'm going to take one more minute to just breathe. Don't force any thoughts to show up. Simply allow them to bubble to the top. Take a deep breath in, hold and retain the breath for a few seconds. Exhale, empty out of your nose. Two more times like that. Deep breath in through the nose, hold, pause. Exhale slowly out of the nose. And one more. Deep breath in. Hold. And exhale. Begin to blink your eyes open. And if you need some adjustment and a little movement, feel free to move your shoulders, shake your hands out. Maybe give your shoulders a couple of little rolls. You can also, sometimes it's nice right after even just a few minutes of sitting, just take a gentle twist. So if you want to take a twist to the right and a twist to the left. And then when you're done with all your... Thank you.